Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be talking about some X Defiant changes and some crazy ass changes. It's been in a crazy two weeks as it's been for X Defiant. So, let's get right into it. So, about a week ago, uh, Mark Rubin, the head honcho at X Defiant, who's basically the community lead and the art, I believe, the, like the director of the game. I can't remember the specific title of him, but he's like the main guy. Okay. So on Twitter, he announced that le weapon XP will be going from 3,500 to 3,000. And, and for pistols, I believe it was 2,000 to... Fi no, no, it was 1,500 to 1,000. Well, ramping up the levels all the way from 100 to 200 while making gold for 200, silver for 150, and bronze for 100. Well, let's just say the community did not like that at all. And let's just say, I got to give credit where credit's due. Mark Rubin took it on the chin. He stood up. He defended the system. However, when the community said, nope, we don't like this change, he's like, okay, well, We'll make a compromise okay how about this change so basically what's going on is now currently right now on the 24th 25th and so on so on so on until future updates uh primary weapon xp is now down from 3000 to 1500 while maintaining the exact same 200 levels and the exact same 200 for gold 150 for silver 100 for bronze or secondary weapons like pistols and such from a thousand to 500 okay then there were some other changes like missing kill confirmation sound is back and fix getting stuck in died while you're spamming melee now that's fixed as well yeah so basically the main thing is the weapon xp changes so i i just i don't know what to say but like this is such a huge w like it's actually really really nice and relief that you see a like a big community of x defiant uh players saying we don't like this system and then you got the head honchos at these game game development studios and well okay we we like our system however since the community doesn't like it we're going to backtrack we respect the community we've listened to your feedback and now we're going to compromise on our vision okay just a little bit and so they introduced all this new system on monday and tuesday stuff and i gotta say this has probably put some much needed life into x defiant well me personally i love x defiant like the gunplay is absolutely amazing the gun, gun skill is high class Probably the best Call of Duty since BO4, and probably and if you don't like BO4, I would say maybe Black Ops 2. However, I'm still a sucker. I still think Advanced Warfare is the most underrated Call of Duty. Yes, this might be a controversial take. Okay, but well, besides that, let's just say I'm super excited for what the X Defiant like just community and reaction to, and the game itself is looking forward to the future. Like if if we can expect these type of changes from feedback from the community i'm kind of curious what's going to be happening next because if the community doesn't like another thing that quote unquote could kill x defiant the devs like okay we'll take that on the chest we'll compromise we will retract and probably try to adjust and make something better and they do and like again this was a pretty fast update i'm not sure um everything was solved or anything like on the bug side but it's still really changes the game technically it's very casual friendly in this situation where it's you don't have to grind for 200 but if you want to unlock all the attachments all you have to do is leveling up to four uh four, level 43 and i think maybe like if you get on some nice little streaks on team deathmatch you might be able to do that like in maybe five games if you go like you get like a 20 kill streak or something like that like if you do a good job in some team deathmatch games you will definitely be able to Let's just say speed up the progression and unlock all the uh, equipment or sorry, attachments for a lot of these guns for casual players. But if you're the hardcore guy who likes to grind out and get that gold, kind of like me for specific weapons, uh, go for it. Like you're going to have so much fun. I think this will definitely bring back like the week one feel and you won't get punished for trying new weapons where unlike in previous Call of Duties where sometimes it takes forever to like rank up your weapons where in this situation where it's like if you want to try a new weapon all you have to do is get a few kills and you're instantly there like you don't have to worry about using if you want to use the M16 you might have to get like four kills now and you pretty much uh, maybe four or five kills you get the level two you use red dot sight and basically the M16 is amazing after that as soon as you get the red dot sight the M16 is absolutely amazing that's what i think <laughs> but besides that uh this is a huge w just to recap this is a huge w definitely looking forward to for more if you like this video hit that like and subscribe down below if you like the gameplay comment down below uh 
that's basically all to say uh it's been a huge crazy week for like all my content and stuff like the amount of views i'm getting the amount of subscri new subscribers i'm getting is crazy uh usually this is not the stuff that i'll be uploading right now i am uploading another video coming later today about the how how rank system works in valorant since that is being released tomorrow on june 26th so i'm super excited we're definitely gonna be grinding some valorant tonight and we're definitely going to be grinding some x defiant maybe after yeah so everybody enjoy the rest of your night peace out hopefully everybody has a wonderful time and i'll see you next time in the next video okay